Hey guys, I forgot to put this video on the Nearpod this morning. So this is how you do rainbow writing, which helps them practice their letters. So I'm going to go ahead and show you. Okay, you can take a pencil and write their name. So I'm going to write my name. Okay, and this is why it's called rainbow writing. You get colors from the rainbow. So I'm gonna start with yellow. Because yellow's in the rainbow. And you do all of the letters yellow. Or whatever color you decide to start with. Next, you can do red, and you trace over the pencil you made where you also had the yellow, tracing over it. So now each letter has two colors on it. Now I'm using green, and I'm just going to use six colors. Now I'm going to use orange. And do your best to stay on the lines. If you go off a little, that's okay. I went off a little bit. No one's perfect. And what colors did Miss Amy miss? Let's see. We got some blue. And I need one more after this. What color did we not use yet? So as you can see, all the letters have been written on with each color. That's a total of six colors. So that means they practiced their names six times in a row. But they don't think they did because look at how pretty and colorful that is. And that looks really neat. These are called rainbow letters. So I wrote my name. This is great for practicing your name. If you're using it for today's activity with the letters. So again, this is great for practicing names if you want another way to practice their name. Now with the letters today, you do an uppercase A and a lowercase A. This is for the literacy lesson because we've been reading a story with the letter A and there's songs with the letter A. So now we're gonna go ahead and we're going to trace these letters so we can use it for the literacy lesson whenever I say do rainbow lessons you do the uppercase and the lowercase and also for practicing names just another fun way to practice we're going to use all the colors that we used to write our name so there's going to be another day I'm going to ask you guys to write rainbow letters and it just means the same thing. Okay. And there you go. So they'll do that and they'll have each letter practice six times because they would have put six colors on each letter. So next time I ask you guys to do letters, if we're doing the letter B, then you'll have the uppercase B and the lowercase B, or if we're doing the uppercase letter S, uppercase letter, lowercase letter. If we're gonna practice the letter T, uppercase T, lowercase T. So whenever we're working on a letter, and I say, let's work on our rainbow letters, it's the uppercase and the lowercase, and then you use six colors on each one. And I hope everyone understands how to work on rainbow letters or rainbow names. And if you have any questions, don't hesitate to email me and have a great day.